The, the, the doctor for 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 Frankenstein. Yeah. 
just could be a Not enough. Give it up, yo! The Red Hot Chili Would you like? 
like your funk stepped upon Is that a yes or a no to stepping on the funk? I'm agreeable. Because personally, I take my uncut. Don't step on it.
Gaga, 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 Gaga. I mean, it's one of the great musical institutions of, of our lifetimes. George Clinton's a genius. He te teamed with so many great musicians, made like, you know, 30 incredible albums. The Parliament started off as a doo wop group in the 50s, and then. Then you know they then they turned into a like acid rock freak out band and was voodoo deepest grooves and then and then and then uh, they got real slick in the 70s and made these incredible you know and had huge hit records in the 70s Mothership yeah. Connection and One Nation Under a Groove and Funk and Teleki and these great great records you know I mean historically important records.
a bit cheeky it's three things i want to ask you i'll be really quick um first what was it like working with red hot chili peppers okay we'll start with the chili peppers anthony and flea i met them in the new music seminar and i had made in a statement that i thought funk would probably go pop when some european group did it like they did with shake it up baby twist and shout you know in the 60s the way rock and roll had I said some punk band probably would 
come from Europe, European pain. So Anthony came to me, why do it have to be from European? Why do it have to be European? Why can't it be from the States? I said, well, if you think you got it, come on out to my farm and we'll, we'll get down. And about six weeks later, they showed up on my doorstep, <laughs> the whole band. I said, oh shit, okay, come on. So they came in, they ended up staying about three weeks. And my wife was gone at the time, so we had the house to ourselves. And we jammed and jammed. And my son had told me, he went to um, high school with him in L.A. He told me how bad them and Fishbone was. They was traveled together pretty much. So I pretty much knew about them, you know, when they came. And we got in there, we got to jam, and I said, oh, they, they serious about this. And we worked and did it. From, they went home. Came back, stayed another three weeks for pre-production at a little small studio, and it was even better. Then we made reservations at United Sound, where I do everybody else. Called Fred, Wesley, and Macy on them in, and we did Freaky Styling. That was a fun record. We had a ball. We all almost went to jail. You know? <laughs> they were young and wild, but they were just like us when we had been that young, so I understood. I got them apartment in Detroit, and um, we finished the record, and we've been working together ever since. You know, when they got their Grammy, um, they called us, and we played with them. You might have seen that. That was a hell of a show. About four drummers, five guitar players, four bass players. It was fun. And every time, matter of fact, if I hadn't been here tonight, I would have been with them at the Super Bowl. They just asked me to come with them. They play in the Super Bowl. Oh, 
Good shirt, that's a good shirt. My man.
love to everybody. Thank you so much for coming to see us. Coming to see George Clinton. Coming with your hearts full of love. Thank you. We love you. Good night. the funk linger, MC's access, smell my finger.
Let's take a look and see what's up today. They're taking away the rights from the people that's wrong. What do the king say? Can we get along? Beat down by the man whose check he paid. Stacy Coons was just a drop in the bucket full of wicked cops. No fire hose could wash that blood away. We caught up with George Clinton to get his thoughts on the Red Hot Chili Peppers helping the music come alive for their version of Let the Good Times Roll. Oh man, it brought it alive. They, they always, when I do that kind of stuff, they always bring it alive. When they played uh, Free Your Mind, You Ask for Follow for Me, that made us start going back and redoing those songs. Oh, they're my, now they're my, they're my boys, I mean, that's like family for real. Well, they on all. They, they, they've been on. I just looked at a lot of the videos the other night. They've been on quite a few of the projects with me. You know, at Prince, at um, at um, Prince when I did Cinderella Theory. Hey man, smell my. Finger. You know, paint the White House black. They was on that. They've been on quite a few, and then we did the Grammys with them. You know, both groups at the same time. Give it away. Dare I say, let's let the good times roll. Come on, baby, let the good times roll. Come on, baby, let me thrill your soul. Come on, baby, let the good times roll.
Producing the red hot chili peppers. <laughs> I don't know what they're going on. They gave me $25,000. <laughs> I'm gonna make a smash out of them suckers. But they don't know what's gonna happen. But turn them suckers out. <laughs> be responsible for the record, you know what I'm saying? It should be a 4-4 four, four thing. I thought we were doing the 11 and 2 thirds for this one. No, that's not funk, man. Oh. I mean, well, uh, funk, perfect funk is jazz. And okay, we ain't playing jazz. Okay. Well, I want to let's try, let's try, let's try one more time. Eat. I say if a guy has a snuffleupagus out when he's playing, he'll always know where the right notes are. That's what I told you in the first place. I know, I know. Come on, let's try it one more time. Stuff Lufkus always leads to good production, I think, anyway. Let me, let me stay out. Give me some earphones. Yeah. Oh, okay. Here we go. Forget the cameras. Forget the cameras. Pretend they ain't here. I mean, to the third balcony. That's who we're singing to. That's who we're playing to. Your mic probably... Yeah, okay. We'll probably have to. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Man, what do you all these colors? You ain't going to use none of them? Hey, man. Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> okay, cool. Turn it off, George, turn it off. Turn it off, Cliff. Cut. Anthony, cut. Okay. Without it is, is the catchphrase. Do you know who we are? Let's yeah, go. Ready? Leave you guys ready? Ready? Okay. Do you know who we are? We're the Red Hot Chili Peppers. And don't leave home without... MTV? MTV. Or George Clinton. That was a dead. <laughs> All right. Uh, uh, the the catchphrase of that commercial, commercial is don't leave home without, 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 without it. Don't leave so we, 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 we Okay, I'll just say George Clinton or I'll say I'll just finish up. Yeah, yeah right. And then okay, say, go ahead. don't leave home without him. Okay. Do you know who we are? We're the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Mm, I'm confused. <laughs> your, your line is don't leave home without no. Don't leave home without it? That doesn't make no, any no, sense after no. that. And this is George Clinton. and That's what I said before. And don't leave home without. And I'll say George Clinton or your MTV. Oh, okay. okay. And don't leave home. <laughs> okay. Don't leave home. No, okay. so wait, we don't go anywhere without. without right. Yeah. Without we don't. Without without our George. George. We don't go anywhere without. MTV without our George, or, George or MTV. Right. right. And I'll yeah. go. And he's heavy. Okay. Do, do, do you know yeah. what? Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. A second. Hold on. Hold on. Do you know who I am? No. no. He's not in the fire line. Wherever you're at. He's an imposter. Do you know who we are? We're the Red Hot Chili Peppers. And don't leave home without your George Clinton. Or your MTV. And we don't go anywhere without it. Yeah, you blew it again. One more time. And we don't go anywhere without and just George stop Clinton. There. Then just stop there. We don't, we don't go anywhere without. OK. OK. Roll them, Flea. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Do you know who we are? We're the Red Hot Chili Peppers. And don't go anywhere without George Clinton or your MTV. And you have to walk out of the camera. Right, next